morning and happy Monday everyone. It's a new vlog, it's a new week and it's the school holiday so I'm not stressed because there's no school run and I will tangle my hair while I speak to you. Um, so uh, the next two days which will be in this vlog I will be basically doing stuff around the house, well if the boys let me but I'll be doing stuff around the house that I've been wanting to do for a long time and I couldn't for because life happened and because I was working and all that. Um, I have a bit of work to do this morning and I will have a bit of work to do in the next few days because I can tell you this even though it's not official yet because by the time this vlog goes live it will already be out so I can talk about it in the vlog. Um, I'm taking part in an Instagram um, giveaway loop so basically it's uh, 30 shops that are planner related shops that are based in the UK that are grouped together and put prizes together and the way it works is that it's a way for us to um, self-promote each other it's a way to because there's a big planner community and the UK one like in America it's crazy uh, but in the UK it's fairly new compared to America so it's growing and growing but um, it's I like the fact that um, we are like there are a lot of sticker shops loads of rich stationery shops and all that we all sell similar products but we are just still supporting each other and we are all small businesses so we kind of need the support from each other so the way it works is that people go and visit all the Instagram pages of the people taking part to, take, to be able to take part and they, there will be two winners and the amount of prizes is ridiculous because everybody will get about 15, like the two, each winner gets about 15 prizes or something like that. So it's several hundred um, pounds worth of prizes for each person which is great. But it does mean that I have to post things at a certain date, at a certain time, on certain days and all that. So I'm going to be <coughs> working on that. I'm also releasing some new stickers um, this week, like today. So I've done a lot of the work actually. What? No, not yet. I'm talking about something completely different, Owen. Just a second. <laughs> I just don't know where that came from. Anyway. Um, so I'm going to be doing that. Then I, this morning I actually did something that I've been wanting to do for ages is to throw through Owen's clothes because a lot of stuff didn't fit him anymore. <coughs> he has grown a lot and we have now a full basket of things I'm that he's throw through. I won't pass it the bathroom. I told him he's growing as a mushroom right now and he was like, how does a mushroom grow? Anyway. So I'm going to sort through it and see what we give to charity, what we keep for Alfie and all that. But one thing is for sure, we are going to need a full wardrobe of clothes for each boy when one comes to the next few days because they have nothing to wear then. <laughs> but that's life and <laughs> it's kind of to be expected. Also, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. Um, are we doing anything? Yes and no. Last year we did really celebrate in style. We went for a spa. Or was it two years ago already? It could have been two years ago. I can't remember. I think it w No, it was last year. It was last year. We went to a spa for two days. Um, and it was lovely, but it's expensive. We can't do things like that every year. So um, this year, it fell at the time where both our car needs serviced. We have to pay for tires. We have to pay for MOTs and all that. And it's all falling at the same, like within a month of each other for both cars. So we need the money to spend on the cars, to have up and running cars that are safe to drive. So we decided we would not do presents. We're just going to do a card tomorrow. And then on Friday, because Sam is here, we can't have like romantic dinners with Sam. Uh, but every time, anyway, we don't, when it falls in the week, we usually do it the weekend before or the weekend after. So what we're going to do is that on, Sat on Friday, James is going to get some cakes um, in a bakery in uh, Belfast and bring them back with him. And sometimes during the weekend, either on Saturday or on Sunday, depending on the program, because we're still waiting on cinema's times to decide that. We will be doing, uh, we will be getting, there's a restaurant, like, not beside us, but like near us, that does take away as well. And we'll just get food for the whole family and have a nice lunch or dinner at the weekend to celebrate that. And 
also Owen and I have bought some supplies. Hold on, Alfie, we're gonna give you one. We've got some supplies hey. for, for Owen to make a um, card for James because he said he loved his daddy, so he wanted to make him a card. Oh, Alfie, you can have all the biscuits. Alfie wants all the biscuits. No, that's Owen. You can have this one. Um, if you're in America, <clears throat> I know that you kind of give Valentine's thing for to people you love, not just your your one loved one. Here, it's more a romantic, like your lover thing. It's you don't give things to everybody, but I figured, why not? He loves his daddy. He's just, it's just nice. So, a lot of things to do. Anyway, that was a massive intro. But uh, I'm probably going to film random things about achievements I've done during the next two days. So I thought, at least you know what is happening. Also, um, Sam is arriving tomorrow night. Uh, we'll be picking him up at the airport very late in the evening. Um, and that will be the end of that vlog. But I don't know if that will be included in this vlog or not. We will see. Um, all the things I'm doing in the house, I'm not doing because Sam is arriving. Sam would ca couldn't care less whether there is mess everywhere or not. Um, but it's just, every time somebody comes to my house, I feel like it's kind of an excuse to do stuff I've been putting back because I couldn't do them. There was other priorities. I usually save enough time to tidy up and all, but usually I do a lot of things that are not because the person's coming, but it's a good thing to do them then. So today I'm having a rubbish berry day. Oh, hold on. I feel fell down. Sunshine! It's alright, baby. You're alright. Come here. He just slipped. I said he didn't really hurt himself. Come here, my baby. Come on. I'm having a rubbish belly day, so... While I'm going back and forth to the bathroom, I decided to tackle something. I have those un storage units. These are the drawers from it. They were just getting dusty inside and dirty. This is a box that's sitting on top. I store like the stuff I use every day and I sorted through like all the toiletries I keep in there and the cleaning products and all that so it's all sorted. That's the vlog schedule for tonight. I've started to put my toiletries back in there. This is all makeup and nail polish. I need to see what I keep um, down the stairs like I have like hair ties and all. I usually get ready downstairs in the morning but, like this is what this has been out since St. Patrick's Day last year because I could have broke green ribbon in my hair so it's gonna be a year soon but yeah it's still out and I, I need to put it back together. Uh, yeah I need to sort through makeup what I keep down the stairs and what I just bring upstairs. I have like a, like a, a bigger vanity case with all my makeup where I store everything that I don't use like every every day so I'm just keeping downstairs in the bathroom just what I use on a daily basis like for everyday makeup so it is now late half eight or something like that yeah half eight and as you can see <laughs> this is still a messy office and not a bedroom for Sam tomorrow yet I have worked really hard today but I am glad to report that all the stickers are online I needed to put uh, all my work for today is done. I just have to do a bit of social networking tomorrow during the day and then that's me off until Saturday and I'm very happy. Um, I'm going to do, I haven't done my own planning for today which I want to do. I want to decorate my planner a little bit and all that. And uh, then I'm hoping that if I do that in my desk here it will inspire me to tackle this room a little bit tonight so I don't have to stress too much tomorrow about doing that if the boys don't cooperate. Uh, otherwise, I can always finish it. Uh, Sam doesn't arrive before half nine in the evening, so um, yeah. But I was, I would like to, if I could have that done tonight, even just tidy it up, and then I'll do the cleaning tomorrow, and that would be great. So I'm gonna get that sorted, and I'll show you. I'll show you before I go to bed what it looks now, like what it looks like. I'll, I'll do actually. I'll show you now. So there's my desk. There's some mess. The bed is overtaken. A lot of things is organized mess now. There's like a filming light, there's a tripod over there. And this is the rest of the desk. It's close to midnight now, but I am happy to report that I will not have to rush to the room tomorrow because guess what? It's finished. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and be easier. So I cleared this so I can put stuff there. There's the bed. There's a guitar because someone plays the guitar. I've left a little chair there, but all the rest is tidied up. This I'm going to move with me, my plan stuff. And there, 
Just this, you know, super tidy, but it doesn't really matter. I've moved my trolley in there as well. And that's too, because usually they sit here. But with the bed being open, there's less space, so I figured I'm not going to need them anyway. Uh, while he's there, so I'll move them in that corner. I'll also put a little message on my light. So I'm now going to head to bed. And uh, tomorrow I'm going to have to go to the dump because I've actually... I've had had boxes of things I need to bring to the dump sitting in this room and on the landing upstairs. And instead of moving the mess, I figured James is currently moving them into my car because he still has shoes on and all. And tomorrow I'm going to do a run there to just dump everything so that will make more room in the house. But yeah, that's a good achievement for today. I feel like I've had a very productive day and I'm very satisfied. I think when I'm being productive, it just satisfies me a lot more than when I have nothing tangible there so that i do so very glad anyway i'm gonna head to bed now and i will see you in the morning good morning and happy tuesday i am exhausted <laughs> um it's quarter past seven james is upstairs uh finishing to get dressed um alfie was up very early and james was trying to keep him down and then eventually alfie went up and woke up everyone and yay i need more sleep so bad um anyway i have quite a lot to do today it's like loads of little tasks um but um there's nothing i really have to do you know <laughs> if it doesn't happen it doesn't happen i need a break so bad i've been working really hard the past few weeks and it's the last day of actual work and then i get a few days off so yes I am, I need, I need a break. I'm at the point where it's not that I want a break, it's that I need a break. Um, <clears throat> it's very hard, as you know, <laughs> to separate work and life and all because I'm working in the house and and sometimes I just get carried away and at the time I'm just thinking, oh, I'm going to do this and this and that and then it's all catching up with me and it gets a bit much. So I am just going to enjoy the break when it's happening. Alfie just woke up, it's half 11 and we are gonna go to the dump in the car. The boys are in pyjamas, I'm in track suits and house clothes and I'm not gonna bother getting everybody dressed simply because we all need a lazy cozy day and um, the boys are gonna be in the car the whole time, they're gonna <laughs> literally get in the car here, stay in the car the whole thing and come back here so they're staying in pyjamas. I'm staying in house clothes because the only place I will be getting out is the dump to dump rubbish where you don't really need to wear fancy clothes so a tracksuit bottom and a hoodie jacket will do the trick. Uh, I'm then gonna go we're gonna go to McDonald's to get them um, something at the drive something I had said to you when we would do during the holidays so we're gonna do it today because it's quite convenient with the way I'm feeling right now, I just I just need to shift this before Sam arrives. I really need to. I didn't manage to sleep. I was hoping to get a nap when Alfie slept, but I ended up just I, I rested, but I didn't manage to fall asleep. So uh, we're gonna do that now, so it's done, and then we can just relax. Um, Owen has been asking if he could play The Sims, and instead of him getting into it, we're gonna do the jump, lunch, and then he can play it. That will keep him busy. And now I doubt Alfie will have a nap this afternoon because he's just slept until now since he fell asleep at half eight, but he was up till four this morning, so <laughs> not great. Uh, but hopefully it means he goes to bed at a decent time tonight, so shouldn't be too, too bad. Anyway, off to the dump, McDonald's and back. Don't you just hate it when you have to park to wait for your order? I just uh, I watched La La Land again. I found it on Cody and Oh my god, that movie every time. It's like this is the third time I see it now. Every time I'm like, oh my god, I love it. I love this. I love that. I love that. And Sam hasn't seen it yet, so probably gonna watch it in the next few days as well. The giveaway we're doing is actually now live on Instagram. It's been a last, like stressful last minute. Um, we're doing like a loop giveaway, so it was like over 30 shops, and we tag each other in a loop, so people have to follow everybody. And when you click on the next picture, it brings you all around. But the logistics behind that are quite complicated, <laughs> and the start of it to make sure it all works 
it's quite stressful but it's all now working fine um so yeah i'm really excited um i'm not thinking about it as a way to get more orders per se i'm more looking at it as some advertising so i'm putting in a, like a gift uh, a gift card for my shop and in return uh, it's a good way for some people who don't know about my shop to discover it so it's good and it's nice to do something with other people who have similar shops i do like the sense of community that there is it makes me very happy it's now 9 pm and i'm off to get sam at the airport he's landing at half nine and it should take me about half an hour to get there i figured by the time he gets out and all that's probably be quarter to and maybe closer to 10 by the time he's out so should be there in plenty of time it's now uh, almost one in the morning so i'm just gonna head to bed sam is in bed everybody's in bed basically and i will see you on saturday in the next vlog if you want to find out what we've been up to when someone's here you're just gonna have to watch it then bye, bye.